Hello and welcome to another episode of my science mode playthrough of Kerbal Space Program in the Genesee Qua Planet Pack. So here you can see I am launching what's basically my uh, go-to super heavy lifter in this series. Uh, and what it is launching is it is launching a probe to Joule. Uh, now why am I using something like this for a Joule probe whenever there's like a bunch of real life spacecraft that uh, have gotten to like Jupiter or whatever the equivalent place in the real solar system is on uh, much weaker rockets. Well, the, the, the reason is I don't want to mess with gravity assists. That's it. And so yeah, and uh, I'm calling this my go-to a super heavy rocket, but uh, but I, I like to call it the uh, Athena Super Heavy, and the reason for that is it's basically the well, it's the heavier version of another rocket I have called the Athena Launch Vehicle, and how that came to be is interesting. It basically uh, I had just unlocked the 3.75 meter parts, and I wanted to use them to send something out to Eve. And I decided to call that mission Athena because, you know, Eve is basically Venus. And Athena is the Greek equivalent to Venus. So, hence naming the Eve mission Athena. And uh, I decided I wanted to use the rocket that launched that mission again. And I decided to name it the Athena launch vehicle and the little sub-assemblies thing, and it all just kind of went on from there. But anyways, here you can see the little probe uh, now that the fairing has been deployed, popped off, whatever. You can see a little magnetometer RPWS antenna popping out. And uh, I hate to say it, but I really made a mistake making this a nuclear powered thing because my thought process was is or I should say nuclear propelled my thought process was oh I'll use a nerve engine because nuclear means more delta V however what I didn't think to take into account is or take into account is since all of my nuclear uh, propelled stuff runs off of liquid hydrogen which is subject to boil off by the time this thing gets to joule Regardless of if the cooling is enabled or not, this thing's going to lose a bunch of its fuel, so I end up being able to pull off a lot less with this thing than I was really planning on, but it's okay because I end up using whatever, what little science I was able to scrounge up from this to unlock ion engines, so yeah, even though the burn times will be excruciatingly slow, uh, at least I got high ISP engines that run on a fuel that won't boil off out of it. And I say what little science, it was actually quite a lot, but whatever, you can see this thing is just making its way to Joule now. Um, not much to really say about it, and I don't know why I'm still attached to this stage because... Yeah, but here you can see this thing's just going on a little lathe flyby and you just got a little peak of Joule out in the distance. And yeah, uh, so I was kind of experiencing a bit of a issue with my visual mods here and ended up with uh, the jewel system not looking the way it's supposed to, but I ended up fixing that pretty quickly. And so yeah, this thing just basically got data from high above jewel, high above lathe, space near lathe, and then got thrown out of the Joule system. So yeah, that was a bit disappointing. And that's that's really all that happens in this episode. I don't even know why I'm recording this. I should probably like add something. This is only gonna be like five minutes long really. Like that's that's not even long enough for this to be monetized if my channel was even at the point of being monetizable. 
so I really don't know why I'm putting this out there because I, I don't know that my channel will ever get to that point but in the event that it does it would be nice to have as much monetizable content as possible you know but whatever um, well I guess with this video done with if you enjoyed it then please consider leaving a like if you have anything to say about it at all, then feel free to leave a comment in the comment section down below. I am open to criticism. And if you want to hear about it every time I upload, please consider subscribing and enabling all notifications. That is all from me for now. Goodbye.